probably something sensible to wish someone in the middle of a war, isn't it? A new episode has been added. In defense of Brule, the Windmill Tower. This is, looks like it's going to be another cutscene, because that doesn't look like a map. Let's see. Uh, Alvin, Simon, and Theodore. Oh, I hated that cartoon. Wow, look at this. Brule's really becoming a ghost town. This town is coming like a ghost town. Just about everyone is evacuated by now. I can't blame them. Tensions are rising with the Empire. We'll survive. If you can tell under those gloves, I'm very impressed. Everyone will come back someday. They'll come back when it's safe again, right? Mm -hmm. So, Welkin, I'm curious. Are you going to join the army like your father? Hmm. I don't think that's for me. What I'd really like to do is be a teacher. Huh. A teacher? Yeah. <laughs> Animals and insects, <laughs> flowers and plants. Her bakery senses passion. were tingling. I've learned a lot from nature. You see, my dad, he protected this country as a general. But it's just that I, I want to give back in my own way. My own way. You know what I mean? I think I do. You're sure about it? Mm -hmm. Wow. That's deep in your own way. Hmm. 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 <laughs> what was that? That sound. Her general, it is, our spies have reported that this town has a very large windmill. We must destroy it at once. Yeah, it's safe to attack. We've got rid of the windmill. So, I don't believe it begins. The mill. Miss Melchior, the Imperials are attacking. There's a squad of them in town right now. Get all the town watch together now. We've got to fend them off. They must be at Mill Plaza. I'll help. Thanks, Welkin. Now move out. Stay low. Bend over. Run in front of me. I like the view. A new episode has been added. Uh, okay, this looks like we are going to have... I don't know why I'm trying to sound like Captain Girk. But it looks like we're going to have a fight on our hands. Let's have a go. I'll explain the mission. I'm glad you would. The enemy has invaded the Windmill Plaza. And she's explaining it in my voice, that's clever, and has taken almost the entire area over. We'll deploy from this position. Hide behind sandbags for cover as you advance towards the plaza. Our goal this time is to eliminate the enemy leader. I'm pretty sure he'll be there in the plaza area. Be careful, there may be any enemy units be hiding behind the buildings out there. Hidden enemies won't show up in the command mode view, so be careful as you make your advance. This game is going to be very, very, very linear. Alright, so... Okay, usual sorts of things here. The enemy leader is defeated for victory. If any of the named characters die, we lose. Or if we take too long, the game just gets bored and walks away. Okay, well, I think we can do this. Okay, let's begin. It's up to us to defend Brule. It's up to us to find a decent name for this city. Are we actually having a, a, a discussion now about who's your favourite chipmunk? Our target is the Imperials in Mill Plaza. See, she... on taking down their captain. Breaking the chain of command should at least buy some time for the townspeople to get away. 
All right, I got it. Let's all be careful out there. Mm. Welcome to Brule, famous for its secondhand bread. Yeah. Got a second? Listen close and I'll explain. About damage. Hello, Team Akish. Welcome back. A set amount of damage a unit has sustained is healed each turn. That's useful. If a unit has taken enemy heavy damage, don't push them. Stay back and heal up. Should enemy attacks drive a unit's HP to zero, the condition becomes critical. In this battle, you have no way of helping a unit's critical condition. Try to fight carefully so no one's HP reaches zero. Okay. Makes sense. Right, we've got three action points, three people. Let's try moving all three up this time. So, getting to cover seems like a good start, doesn't it? About sightlines. Uh, when a unit sights an enemy in action mode, a sightline will appear over his or her head. Yes, we worked that one out. Uh, the line connects to the enemy. Choose a guide when attacking or when trying to position your units in a spot where they're safe from enemy attacks. Crouch, thank you. All right, target mode. About attacking enemies. Yes, we know this. You told us in the last one. All right, the enemies attacking units. Okay, right. Yeah, I know we're still in the tutorial, but there we go. Excellent. Right. All right. Okay, so this is a Japanese game, so the zeros are, the, the, the zeros are ticks, so this, uh, the weapon he has is um, good against personal, uh, but not against armor, and it's not an, an area attack either, so let's aim for the head, and fire. Got him. Yes! Ah, you won't be answering her back now, dead person, will you? Okay, so, right. Right, let's back out of this one, because he's already shot, and I don't want to move him any further. And let's move the next person up. And that will be this guy here, the town watchman, the man with no name. Right. Okay. So this guy's undercover, so he's going to be harder to hit, but let's give it a go. Yes. Yeah, I think next time what we're going to have to do is actually uh, um, fight using a, a barn door. Because that seems to be all that guy can hit. Right, let's get Alicia up. Let's go! And a cover, and target mode, and fire! Oh, we didn't get him done because he's under cover, but still, we got one person dead. Don't like the way that they, they just carry on firing. Hmm. Simon the Red Shirt! Hee <laughs> hee! He decided to fall back, stroke, get shot. Excellent, works for me. Right, is our turn yet? Oh, he did a good job there. That guy is pretty now, now pretty hurt. Okay. All right, we'll start with Wilkin. We Why not? Take this. Yes, take this, sandbags. Right, end the current action. Yep, I've got to be honest with you. Alicia seems to be the badass one at the moment. All right. And fire. Oh, two points left. 
it does appear that we are going to be stuck here. And the current action. Trying to kill this guy for a bit. And if we are, I'm going to move one of these guys up next time. Fire! Come on! Oh, well done. Right, now... Let's see if we can actually move this guy up. We've got plenty of action points, so let's just move up one. That's going to make it easy for us next time. And... Yeah, okay. While I'm uh, being indecisive, he's getting shot. So let's end that turn there because he can't shoot anymore. End the current phase. Yep. Uh, it, unfortunately, it looks like these guys shoot soap as well. So we got Matey hidden behind the corner there. Go on, you can do it. You can do it. Oh, you left him with three hit points. The French ones. Right, okay, back to it. Let's do Alicia first. And... I'm thinking we can go up and find cover behind those boxes there. Let's see if it works. We can't find cover behind these boxes. Alright, let's just shoot. Excellent. Alright, and now let's try to find her some cover. Uh, hey. Right, so this is not cover. I'm wondering if we leave it up here. Uh, space to crawl. Well, that'll do. Okay, she's fairly safe there. End the current action. Right. Let's do the man with no name and see if we can get a, um, a bead on that uh, flashing question mark there. Crouch, have a quick look around here. Let's shoot this guy because he's nice and out in the open. Just go a little bit lower. Oh, you, oh, oh. I'm so disappointed in you, man. I'm so disappointed in you. And the current action. Right. It's now up to Welk. Sorry, Welkin. Right. Ready to go. Let's go. Let's sprint up here, get into cover, and shoot that guy. Take this. Yes! Yes! I'm the hero because I've got extra animations. Eleanor, Eleanor fan one <laughs> because of the chipmunks. <laughs> oh, Alyssa Book Clover, hello. And the current action, yes! In the current phase. Yes. Right, we killed three. Um, um Oh good lord, will you look at the number of actions they have? We saw none of it. Okay. Let's start off with Alicia. Turn, okay. Stand. Will you let us jump over? No, we've got to get out. Because... How dare you think that you can do something other than jump over sandbags. Enemy unit spotted! Enemy unit spotted, right. Take cover. Let's shoot this guy. Okay. 
Okay, that wasn't bad. Alright, you're not very hurt. So I think... Uh, actually, let's pull you back. And you can stay here. And current action. No sense leaving you there to get shot at. That's what these guys are for. What we'll do is we'll take you here. And you can shoot this guy. I said you can shoot the guy, not shoot around the guy. Okay. Never mind. You're not likely to take much damage from him. So. Let's get Mr. Watchman up as well. Over you go. Take cover. And you shoot this one. Yes, one down. And pull you back as well. Yeah, behind that cover there. Right. And the current action. And the current phase. It's those sandbags, they've taken an awful beating. I'm going to try hiding behind these bad sandbags. Oh, that didn't work too badly. Nice. Okay. Take this. Take this, sandbags. I'm assuming that the action points we're not seeing are because those those people are actually uh, hidden. Ready to go. So we'll start off with him. I'm thinking that we might as well go over this, run up here, take cover, and shoot from here. Now. Excellent. Oh! Nice! That was the leader! Hey hey! What's that? Sounds like a tank! Yeah, I say that's a tank, alright? I suppose if you're going to shoot that much soap, it's going to hurt. Do you know what? I'm never actually really big fan of when Simon eats the poop. Though I can understand their hatred for... Oh, there's more? Right, guys, what's the odds that we need to aim for the glowy blue thing? Ah, oh, melody flower. Are we getting the same this? Tank. <laughs> Just in case you hadn't noticed. That's not good. We're not equipped to take out a tank.
They brought a cave troll. Sorry, a tank. But we should probably pull out for now. Yes. It's it's the only way to be safe. Uh, you could have brought some condoms, but you didn't. Oh, no. Get off this road and into the alley to the east. It's too narrow for a tank to follow. And try to stay behind cover while moving. One blast from that turret and it's over. You can tell this is anime based because they have time to stop and have a little lecture in between uh, getting shot at by a bloody great tank. <sighs> Dear. Right. Victory is Welkin reaches the destination, Welkin dies, Alicia dies, or 20 turns task for failure. Uh, okay, so okay, so we've got to get down to here by the looks of it. And we're held here. Okay, it actually occurs to me that we're probably going to want to kill that tank off if we can. Uh, if we can do that, that would actually be bloody good. Uh, let's just line up a little bit. There we go. And then book it. And I'm thinking. You know, if we run over there, we're just going to get lots of people shooting at us. Let's run over there. Well, we've got plenty of time. Let's go over to here. Crouch. That's going to be an interesting place to be. That's probably going to be a bad idea, but let's do it anyway. End of current action. Bravely run away, yes. Okay, right. We're going in the right direction. So, right. Ready to go. Welky boy. Watch been watching too much Yu-Gi-Oh recently. Right. You can have a go at this as well. Take this. Nobody seems to be doing something. Run away. Hey baby, do you come here often? And the current action. And let's also move the red shirt. Do you know, I'm actually fairly convinced that if I was to use Welkin again, I could get him over to here. And that would probably do the trick. But Oh, I also want to use this red shirt and see if I can shoot at the tanks some more, but... Uh... Here we go. Oh, it makes sense. Come on. We're doing our movement points. Uh, not enough. Let's go back over here. Crouch. Oh no, we get another shot, don't we? Uh, target mode. See if we get rid of one of these guys. Now that'll make things slightly easier. Oh dear, he is really hurt. I think I've done really something really stupid here. Oh, I've got more action points. Excellent. It's not that bad. It's not that bad.